Hi guys, welcome back to another video and welcome back to another Mail Monday. So without further ado, let's jump straight into the video. Okay, um, today's a special Mail Monday because I'm wearing green um, and this is the first time I've worn green on a Mail Monday. That's not really that special, but it just means that because I'm not using my green screen now, you um, you won't see a floating head like I'm in uh, some dodgy knockoff version of Harry Potter. But there we go. My body's gone. I know what that is. That's an invisibility cloak. Um, I've got about five packages today. We've got our tools at the ready. I've got my scissors. We've got our little uh, tool. What do we call this? A um, crafting tool. And this funny thing that my, my grandma and my granddad watch my videos and they have got me this very fancy looking letter opener. Um, so I will be definitely swashbuckling some letters in a second. But we'll start off with letter number one and this has come from Germany. I have done my due diligence this time and actually removed the address to save the painful editing a bit later on. Excited to get some of these open because I've been ordering some very cool cards as of recent that I'm excited to show out on off on the channel. So for card number one, start with a bit of uh, football soccer, and we've got a, uh, a Florian Newhouse uh, from Brusham and Gladbach. This is his rookie card from 2018-19, I believe, or is it 2020? No, it is 2020. It's the it's the most recent uh, Bundesliga set. A very exciting young uh, midfielder playing in the Bundesliga. I know Apso Cards is big on him. He's been picking up a lot of cards of his as of recent. Um, so yeah, he is something, someone who is uh, who's looking to be quite exciting. And I haven't seen too many cards on eBay. They kind of pop up like not very often. Um, so I don't know if that means people are holding him or people just aren't interested in selling him. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not 100% sure on that one. So I think we are just going to rip this. There we go, we used it. Okay, let's uh, throw that away. So we've got some nice packaging on this one, don't mind that. And we have, okay, that I ended up trying to buy, and this is actually the Paolo Rossi, as you can see at the bottom here. I tried to buy a Paolo Rossi card from this set. And instead, there's, there was another player called Rossi, um, and I ended up picking up him instead of Paolo. So it pays to not snipe things on eBay without actually reading the description or looking into the player. So this is from 76 to 77. So I believe this is his second year. Um, correct me if I'm wrong. And if I am wrong, what I'll do is I'll put the rookie card up in the... Uh, the sort of the right hand side of the screen as I have done with some previous Mail Mondays. But yeah, this is um, this is Paolo Rossi here on the right hand side. It's obviously one of those three stickers that we, we've seen with the uh, FIFA 365 and other ones. But yeah, a, uh, an, a nice, nice pick up there. While we're here, let's leave it up and stick it into the top loader. There we go. Can't go wrong with a bit of Paolo Rossi. Right, so for package number three. We have. What's this? I hadn't opened. Whoops. Looks like I've just been sent some cardboard, apparently. I'm assuming it's under here. Right, okay. Thank God. We weren't just paying for some expensive cardboard. Right, we have. Oh, yes, this is one that I've waited on for a long while. I'm just going to pick up the parcel side. Gracefully threw on the floor there. 
This is, and actually I did a, a video on my TikTok recently of picking up um, this card here from Tops, and this is the Lewis Hamilton. I suppose it'd be the second Tops that he has, as he's got one with a yellow background, which a lot of people are putting up as his rookie card on eBay. So if you're looking for his rookie, he does have earlier cards, but they're super, super expensive. But his, his first Tops card, I believe, is apart from the match attacks, is the Tops now has got a yellow background. It goes for about fifty pounds on eBay at the moment. So that's kind of his second release card. And someone actually said, "I'd like to see some more." Um, F1 from your channel. Now I don't really know that much about F1, I don't know that much about driving, but obviously being English, I've heard of Jackie Stewart. And this is a set I really, really like as well. So this is the Panini Calciatore 1966 set, um, which had all types of famous sportsmen in it. There we go, look at that. And this is the Valida, and I've explained on, um, I've explained on other uh, videos before. There's the uh, Valida, and then there's the Baz Valida, and the Baz is obviously for two credits, and this is for one, and then you would trade these in for football uh, shirts and leather footballs, that sort of thing, back in the day. So this is a very, very nice card. Now this is his rookie card, uh, Jackie Stewart rookie card, yep. Um, so I'm, I'm very happy to have that in my collection. And I did pay too much for it as well. It isn't in the best condition. The centering's not as good as some of the other ones, but they were um, on the uh, more expensive side. And as a, as a kind of a not an avid F1 fan, I don't know too much about F1. I was like, well, I'm not gonna go to, sort of balls to the wall on these. I'll just, um, I'll just get one that I can afford really just to have in the collection. Whether it goes off for grading or not, I'm not 100% sure. Uh, we'll have to see, but that's one I've been uh, excited to open. Should probably do this away from me rather than towards me. Okay, got rid of that mess. So this uh, is, I'll give a shout out to, let's put this lid on before I end up slicing my finger open. Um, I'm gonna give a shout out to two channels uh, that I always probably give a shout out to, but and I'm sure you subscribe to both of them, but you've got the Brit Breaks and Takes and LDN Cards have both covered these. And this is um, the Eevee on the Ball. So this is the Futsal Promo. Um, we have the other one over here, and I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm just going to collect the set of these because I just thought it was quite cool that we saw sort of a, we're seeing Pokemon explode at the moment, and I probably will be doing a podcast on this as well. Um, but this is kind of like a sports cards Pokemon sort of crossover, so that's why I quite liked it. Um, we've been collecting a lot of sports and soccer cards recently. Pokemon's blown up, and I thought these were sort of a good cards to, to, to really start us off with. Um, there's a new one out every week, so the first week was EV. I had to order that one on eBay as I did miss out on it. Um, we've got Grookey, and then there's uh, a couple, there's a fire one and a water one, um, forgive my Pokemon knowledge, um, to come out uh, in the next coming weeks. Um, and there is actually a, there's a Pikachu one as well. If you're part of a futsal team, um, you can actually apply to get the uh, the Pikachu card. So what it is is you you spend fifteen pounds worth of credit in game, which is a store in the UK. This is a UK exclusive, which is kind of another reason why I jumped on it. And um, you get one of these cards for free. Now these cards are going on eBay for fifteen pounds. So what you could do is you could pick up fifteen pounds worth of Pokemon cards, sell that on eBay for fifteen pounds, and then rip the Pokemon cards for free, essentially. And then if you get something good, you can make a profit. Well, anything's a profit. If you make, if you sell a card, one card for 20p, it's a profit. So yeah, a bit of fun. Um, and I, yeah, wanted to collect the set, but obviously missed the um, the Eevee, so 
I just decided to pick that up on eBay. Um, okay. And in package number, whatever this is, four. We have some Kulisevsky. Um, is this sellotapes on here? Yeah, that is sellotape. I thought that was the top of the. Right, okay. Now, this isn't. This. Uh, this card did come with it. I'm not. I'm sure I've, I've mentioned it before on, on Twitter or if you've asked me about it or, or TikTok or maybe in other videos. I don't tend to like to pick up adrenaline. Um, they are very common cards. Um, the European ones are slightly. seem to do slightly better than the actual English ones. But I did pick up this card for this particular sticker. So this is um, Kulusevsky. Sevsky. He currently now plays for, uh, he made a big move to Juventus recently. So he's a forward playing for Juventus. Um, he scored multiple goals for Juventus already. He looks to be a very, very exciting young player. So this is his rookie sticker. Um, I've ordered this and then this came with it. And I also somewhere, um, I don't think I've got it on the table next to me. He does have, if you're looking for his rookie card, a Panini Chronicles. So he's got a very cool Panini Chronicles card, which I picked up for around £20. Um, obviously, I'll show you the price of the, uh, the the amount that I paid for this particular rookie sticker. Um, but this is from the Calciatore figurine 2019-20. So this year is his rookie year. But obviously, this is um, this is just before he moved to um, before he moved to uh, Juventus. So there we go. Uh, and that is the last package I have for today's Mail Monday. So actually, the first time we mentioned Pokemon on the channel, but there you go, there's something new. We've got a bit of racing in there with uh, Jackie Stewart. We've got some recent rookie cards that I could recommend you pick up. Um, I think he's a good one to go for. Uh, same with Florian uh, Newhouse, very, very young young players. And then some vintage in there with um, with Paolo Rossi. So there we go. I hope you did enjoy this Mail Monday. If you did, please do drop a big like on the video, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you on the next Mail Monday. Thanks very much.